Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Whether your repair is simple or complex, you'll be more successful if you break the procedure down into steps, making it more manageable. I'll take you through this part replacement repair one step at a time. To replace the freezer door switch sensor in this LG refrigerator, you will need a jeweler's flathead screwdriver, a flathead screwdriver, needle nose pliers, and a Phillips screwdriver or drill driver with a number two Phillips bit. Be sure to unplug the appliance before working with any electrical components. Fully extend out the top freezer tray by lifting the front, then pull out the ice container. Next, pull and lift out the freezer tray. Lift the bottom freezer drawer out from the rear. Use the jeweler's screwdriver to depress the tab on the drawer gear and pull up to detach it from the slide rail. Pull the bar away from the other gear. Loosen and remove the two Phillips screws securing the freezer door and lift it up and out to remove it. Now remove the three screws on the freezer rail and unplug the sensor. Pull the rail from the cavity. Using the pliers, squeeze the sides of the sensor to release it. To install the new freezer door switch sensor, insert and snap the sensor into the rail. Position the rail assembly into the freezer cavity with the back tabs first. Plug in the sensor, then thread and tighten the three screws. Set the freezer door by hooking the connector rails to the sliders. Screw in the two Phillips head screws to secure the door. Insert the bar into the set gear and snap the gear on the other end into its slot within the slide rail. This can be difficult to align. Place the drawer back inside the freezer.
slide the tray back into the guide rails. Then insert the ice container. Plug in the appliance. The LG refrigerator should now be ready for use.